Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh brothers and sisters I hope you're doing well and welcome back to this new episode on the show hadith series and today's hadith was actually mentioned in al-Bukhari and it was narrated by Abu Huraira radiallahu an in which he said that the messenger of Allah sallallahu alayhi wa sallam said man kana yu'minu billahi wal yawm al-akhir fal yaqul khayran aw liyasmut that whoever believes in Allah azza wa jal and in the final hour in the last hour in yawm al-qiyamah then let him say something which is good or let him remain silent and subhanallah this is very important because this is actually a principle uh, within our religion and every single day we talk a lot and we say things that sometimes we mean that sometimes we don't mean that sometimes we don't we don't even know what we're saying and it's very important that actually before we speak we are very careful as to what we say is what I'm going to say something that will benefit me and be with me, for me on Yawm al Qiyamah or will it be something that's against me and this is very very important and this is a reminder to myself first and foremost and then to you guys and it's very important that we actually think before talking and we sit down and we reflect upon even the things that we've said and perhaps if we have in any way shape or form uh, affected someone's lives with our words in a negative manner then it's upon us to take that on board to ask for forgiveness and to go to them and to you know clarify things so it's very very important that we are very careful as to what we say and again this is uh, subhanallah sometimes we backbite we slander and we don't even realize it sometimes we might even realize it but we say oh no i said something very little oh no it's fine oh it's not that deep and it's very very important that we don't fall into these mistakes because these are traps sh uh, set down by the shaitan and we are falling into them so it's very important that when we say something we are saying nothing but the truth and we try to make sure that we are conveying the truth in the best way possible just like the prophet alayhi salam done it and we try not to say bad things about individuals and we say only that which is true and that is beneficial and good if you guys want to watch any of the other short hadith series playlist any of the videos will be down there in the description below and one thing i wanted to mention is that i do have two channels and i'm sure you guys probably know this but one is uh, a channel where i do vlogs productivity all sorts of stuff it's basically my life and obviously because islam is the most important thing in my life then islam is by default uh islamic videos on my main channel you'll see a lot of videos which are islamic related in fact every video is islamic related but this channel is specifically specifically just islamic content and i'm not looking forward to get anything from this channel you guys can do whatever you want uh, you can share the videos you can do whatever you want it doesn't really matter this channel is purely islamic and i don't actually have a a uh, specific specific upload date but alhamdulillah i try to upload whenever it comes to my head and whenever my intentions are right and i'm feeling good so this channel is purely islamic i'm not looking at any of the things from this channel it's just any videos so don't guys don't expect like 10 videos in one day or don't even expect one video a month sometimes i might just upload literally five videos in one day and then not upload this is something this channel is just for me to make sure my intentions are right and to make some videos that are purely purely islamic for anyone to benefit and whereas my vlogging channel so of and all other things that you can see on my channel that's where i upload every single week i hope that makes sense uh, just to clarify things but may allah bless you guys and keep me in your du'as that's the only thing i need nothing more nothing less guys so keep me in your du'as and i ask allah Azawajal to make us among those who are successful in this life and in the hereafter and to make us among those who can understand the hadith uh, and to be able to implement it in our daily lives to memorize it and to convey it to the rest of the people and other than that guys if you do need any of the Islamic videos links down in the description below and keep me in your du'as and I'll see you in my next video take care and assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh